fast and easy and it allows you to be able to see everything. I don't know if you guys know, but HSN has actually partnered with DreamWorks Animation mm -hmm. to bring their new movie, Trolls. Have you heard of it? Well, you can do, have a unique collection that has been inspired by the film on our website, but HSN's very own Mr. Curtis Stone <laughs> is the voice of a character in the movie. True. So you've got to go see it just for that reason alone. And we want to give you a little bit of behind the scenes look at one of your recording sessions. Let's take a look at it now. This is going to be good. I can't <laughs> wait. So Let's fun. see it. We're here at the DreamWorks Animation Studio in Glendale, California. We're about to record the voice of Todd, who's my character in the Trolls film. Trolls! 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 It was really awesome. I didn't know there were so many ways to say the same thing. Do you really think I can be happy? Do you really think I can be happy? Great. <laughs> I now have two kids, so my life is all about those movies right now. And Trolls, it's such an exciting concept. I'm very, very honoured to be a part of it. Thank you. Bravo, we got to see you in that. <laughs> well, how was that? Was that a it was, great experience for you? You know what? It was really, really fun. I mean, don't get too excited. I've only got about three lines. It's not like I'm pushing for Justin Timberlake's job. <laughs> but it was really fun. I really enjoyed it. And my son is a huge fan of all those kind of movies. So we, I haven't been to take him yet. I told him that I wasn't going to go to a premiere or anything at all. I was going to wait and take him to the Aww. cinema with me. So we're going to go together. Well, that's going to be great. So be sure to go see the movies Trolls. It's in theaters now now mm -hmm. and shop on hsn.com from beautiful selections that, that were inspired from the movie. Thank you so much for being here at HSN. This is going to be our final hour together, but we Just saved some. Just wait till you see what we've got for you. Let's my dive life. into it. Oh my goodness. This is the dream piece. Mm. Or, well, pieces. It's a two in one, right? So what it is, I'm going to show it to you right now. I've got it's a casserole or something similar looking, right? It's a giant roaster. It's a saute pan. Oh, Look, my I've done, goodness. I've done the short ribs, but here's the real cool part of this. Look at the lid. It is another pan, okay? So you just, I'm gonna wipe the condensation out of that and I'm gonna start grilling some steaks in there. Are you kidding me? No, it is just such a beautiful piece. I'm sorry, wow. all of my stove is off. So I'm just gonna have to start by turning it all on. Uh, because without heat, it's really hard to cook. <laughs> Here we go. Okay, good idea, Rochelle. So you see the short ribs, though, and I'm going to do a whip around and show you everything that we've got because these short ribs have been slow cooked in the oven. It's such a delicious, beautiful uh, um, way of cooking. They look amazing, by the way. Think about Thanksgiving, right? You're going to do a turkey. Well, here's your turkey right there. Look at that guy. Beautiful. Next to it is the, gr is the stuffing or the dressing, as we call it. So they go side by side. Right. We're going to do roast chicken. Chickens. We've done racks of lamb, and then all the vegetables can oh be done in the word. lid or the side pan. So there's, um, did you say on oh my word or on oh my bird? Oh, because oh my word is what I said. On oh my bird, you could be talking about the turkey or the chicken, <laughs> and I don't know which one's better, but they're, they're both going to be tasty. I was looking at this. What is this? Oh, Rochelle, come and talk to us about your French toast. I saw this, oh, and yeah. I was like, oh, yeah. what is that? Well, Tell me about it's it. It's a little breakfast French toast. Is it hot? It's an overnight want... French toast. You can put it together in the evening and bake it off in the morning, and then you could just serve it with a little caramel sauce. Oh, geez. Oh, gee. Thanks, Rochelle. And really, it could be breakfast or dessert. It's so... Yummy. Isn't this? It's wow. just so... Wow. Oh, my gosh. So this piece is spectacular. It is brand new. Uh, you're using every inch of right. both pans that you're getting. Uh, it's at the holiday price of $69.95. Oh, nice. Look at that. Lasagna that's just come straight out of the oven. And imagine... Look, I'm going to show you the depth of this pan, right? Look at the depth. It's kind of heavy when it's full of lasagna. But look at that. It's huge. That's so great. You can, any kind of stew or pasta bake or mac and cheese, you name it, and you can do an incredible, incredible job. Well, don't miss your chance to buy it. We've had over 500 people to pre-order. Uh, it is brand new, perfect for holiday. You know the one thing we need during this time of year. 
our roasting pans. And it's genius in the way that it's designed. Um, it's on four credit card payments of $17.49 with free shipping, and it is on sale. This is the design that is in red, and then, of course, the black is that classic, beautiful black. The handles are unique in this one. Makes it very easy. I don't know if you can see the grooves. So it makes it very easy for you to be able to grab those handles. And then, of course, the same feature uh, that we've been talking about, that, that nonstick uh, that we love, that quantanium nonstick that you can't hurt, that you don't have to add oils, butters, and fats. Brand new, very limited. We only have 2,000 to go around. If you'd like to order it, take advantage of that extended holiday return policy, but we're back off to California oh, yes. to say hi to Margaret, who's joining us live. Hi, Margaret. You're live with Chef Curtis Stone. Hey, Margaret. Oh, we love... Oh, no. Oh, Margaret, Margaret, we apologize, but we're going to say hi to Sally from California. Hey, Sally. <laughs> hi, Curtis. Thanks. How you doing? I love your, your, your pan. What have you got, Sally? Tell us which piece you've got. I've got the Dura pan. I originally wanted want that one that you had have two pans, you know, back and forth. <clears throat> yep. And you sold out, Al. So, and I saw the Dura pan. So I bought the Dura pan, and I loved it using it. It's, um, such, it's such a good place. And then, then when I saw the other pan, I went ahead and bought two of them, one for, my, one for me and one for my niece. And what do you um, like about it, Sally? What do you like cooking in there? And what? how do you find uh, the cleanup? I do a lot of stir, stir fry. Um, I've also baked lasagna in it. Um, I do like soap cheese on it. Yum. And that's what we expect from everyone, right, Sally? Oh, yeah. And thank you so much for joining us and being a part of the show. The versatility of the pans that yeah. you have, which is so terrific. That same kind of concept that Sally was referring to is similar to what you did here, right? Yeah. Allowing you to be able to use every piece. And you, you know, know what? It, it sort of, in some ways, inspires the creativity of what we cook, what we have to cook yeah, with, that's true. right? And if you look at that, I think straight away, casseroles, pot roasts, you know, braises, and then I take the lid off and I'm like, oh, roast, racks of lamb, legs of lamb, standing ribs of beef, roast chicken, you know, so you can roast so much stuff. And then I think pastas, think of the mac and cheese and the lasagnas and the, the pasta bakes that you can do. Um, and, and then, you know, when I look at this side, I'm like, oh, every Everything sauteed, you know, vegetables, of course, any kind of sides. Be great for grilled cheese sandwiches. Oh, yeah, it would. I mean, oh, because yeah, would. these same pans that you're going to bake in, the chef is using them just as regular pans on top of the stove. And that's what you can do when you're shopping for high-quality pans. So it's amazing. I mean, you literally use these every day. You know, when you think of roaster pans, usually you think in Sunday dinner, right. special occasions. But the way that you're using them, this is Monday through Friday, any sure day is. of the week, you know? Go over to our website, hsn.com. This is brand new. Almost 400 people are calling in right now, more than 400. And we only have 2,000. So this could be one of the final chances. We'll lose one of the colors for sure in the hour. We have the red, and then we have the classic black. But ideal. If you're going to be doing any type of holiday cooking, the presentation is elegant. Absolutely stunning. It's so beautiful. And you know, look, I'm, I'm just throwing mussels in here with some mm. wine, some shallots, some peppers, some thyme. And then if you want it, you just get the lid. Uh, if I can find a lid anywhere. Well, I'll let Sorry. you borrow mine, although it's a different color. <laughs> here, I'll give here. Here, here you we go. go. Here's one. You got one? Thanks, Eric. I'm gonna, it's gonna be a mismatched here color. Go. I have one match. Okay, yeah, get a black one. There in we there. go. Beautiful. Thanks, Marla. You're welcome. Um, so, you, you know, like I said, this is, of course, what we are cooking on when it's turned this way. But when we want to steam, you just go ahead and stick it, turn it around that way. Have a look at the size of these giant New York strip steaks. And check this out. Beautiful caramelization. You know, I'm going to turn these now, and then I'm going to turn them back again. Look wow. at the color we're getting on these steaks. I mean, that is amazing. And that's on a moderate heat. You know, like, 
I'm, I'm going to let you guys in on a little secret. We're doing this live, okay? <laughs> <laughs> and sometimes things go exactly how we want them, and sometimes they don't. When we rolled this table out, we had no heat in the, right. in, in the table. And now it's just starting to kick in, so you're about to see the way this can work. But look, guess what? That happens at home too sometimes, right? It doesn't go the way we want it. But if you've got good product, um, it's, it's going to solve the problem for you. So, you know, whether it's these Brussels sprouts that I'm caramelizing over here, or the, uh, um, the the mussels, like I said, that we're, we're steaming under there. Check that mm. out. They're already starting to open, so in it just all, minutes. It looks, it looks so good. What a wonderful gift to give. You know, the wonderful thing about shopping for the Dura pan or the cookware set or the brand new roaster pan is that every pan or pot that you go to reach for has that consistent performance. Yep. You know, you don't want to have one fabulous pan and a whole bunch of pans that are not so good. So right. a roaster is something that we should all own. Mm -hmm. um, the fact that this can be used in amazing ways, just as traditional fry pans, and that you can use both the lid and the bottom portion. By the way, we do give you the rack, so that comes along with it. So you actually get three pieces with this, which is right. wonderful. So cool. But it's ideal. It's all brand new. You don't own this. So if you want to get what's new. Or Rochelle. Don't $20 be sneaking savings. that in there. What you, yeah. What'd you do? That looks so delicious. Come show everybody at home. We just what took is some it? turkey, leftover turkey, made some enchiladas with it, put some sauce in it. And they do like a casserole. Yeah. I know. But the way that you describe it, Rochelle, she's like, oh, she's I like, oh, she just throws it away. Yeah. Oh, no, it's nothing, really. <laughs> I'll tell you what, that's my lunch right there. I'm going to take a couple of these guys. It looks so good. Oh, my word. Cheesy and fantastic. That does look divine. Come on. Well, as you shop with us, come on in and say hi. I'm going to ask my producer to give you an update, Mr. Adam, on which color we'll lose first. Oh, yes. The muscle. Red. Red. Uh -huh. Makes sense, right? So right. Everyone loves red. Yeah, for sure. Number one accent color. You know, when I first thought, I thought it was cast iron. Right, it looks like, and you know what? Here's the good news. You can use it as cast iron exactly the same way. Imagine frying chicken in this. This would fry the best chicken. Um, you know, making popcorn in it. You can, there's literally nothing you can't You know, you I can't never really, really thought about that. You're right, because you, you have it on top of the burner. Right. So you, you, you could, that would be great to fry chicken in. Look at all the, all the room that you have, And here's you know? the cool part. Like, I've, I've done the mussels in here. You call everyone to the, to the table, right? You say, dinner's ready. Everyone comes along. Once they all come, you do this. You lift that lid and look, boom, there you go. And what's so cool about it is I'm gonna finish that with just a little parsley, like so. And just, if you open those up, look at those muscles. It's black on black, so they're hard to see, but it is so delicious. Then I've gone and taken the lid straight off the mussels, just giving it a quick wipe out, and you're ready to cook again. So I'm gonna throw some chorizo in there and crisp that up and put uh, some chicken on it. Uh, right, so we're going to get these steaks out. Have a look at the caramelization on both sides of those New York strip steaks. Fantastic. It's like that's what you want, right? That beautiful I'm, color. I was trying to find a fork and a plate. So a fork I and just, a plate? Yeah. I'll get you one. I can't take it anymore. I was trying to be so good. It just smells too divine <laughs> in the studio. Doesn't it smell good? Oh, uh, I'd like it all. <laughs> short rib? Those are I'll amazing. Take short, I'll take a short rib. <laughs> the short rib I'll take a short rib. <laughs> so <laughs> here's what you get, by the way. I just got an update. Now black is selling faster than the red. Oh, wow. That's I unexpected. Know. I'm surprised by I that, know. actually. Well, it's last call. Right. Um, let's go back to the phone lines. We have Luann from Michigan that wants to say hello. Luann, you're live with Chef Curtis Stone. Hello. Hello. Thank you for taking my call. And you sound wonderful. I am so excited about this cookware. First, I wanted to say thank you to Curtis for providing us with the most amazing, durable, nonstick cookware that I have ever, ever used. My whole family uh, you're has so it. welcome. Um, my brother found you first and actually clued me in that if I wanted a truly durable, nonstick cookware, that lives up to every single same, every nonstick versatility, durability thing that you talk about, this is it. Um, so I have the full set of cookware, I have the fry pans, I have the grill pans. I love this cookware and I really wow. wanted to thank you. Isn't I've talked so on other networks and unfortunately they really didn't live up to their claims. And um, 
I was skeptical. I started with a fry pan. And I will tell you, once I had them, I had to have everything that you own. Oh, it's nice. phenomenal. <laughs> it truly is. That's so cool. That is just so awesome. How nice is that? And Luann, thank you. I'll tell you what, that makes me feel so good, yeah. Luann. Because no, I think that's so wonderful, Luann. It's nice to meet you, and thank you for sharing that with us. Because you're right, I think so many of us can relate to Luann. You know, you try different brands, and you really do hope that it will deliver. Right. The features that they say, and most often we are disappointed. Thanks. And I love that Luann talked about how she really loves this cookware. The wonderful thing about the roasting pan, because it is brand new, this is the first time that we've ever offered it this year, this is this visit, is that it has those same features. So I made that point a little bit earlier. It's nice, yeah. once you get used to cooking with these pans, I mean, there's nothing like them on the market. Right. Um, by the way, this is one of the best things I've ever eaten is in my so life. It's so good, that's Rochelle's famous shirt. Rochelle, shortage. I mean. It's Rochelle, so, Rochelle. <laughs> so tender, what, so she's, delicious. She's, she's doing that girl. Yeah, Check but it's this out. easy when you have great pans, you know? Right, so I'm, I'm just going crazy right now because wow. I'm, I'm running out of space and I'm doing it on purpose. Let me know I how I can help show you, you, How much stuff there is to do. <laughs> Don't worry, you, you, you have your short room. That's way more important. <laughs> but look at what we've done here. All we've done is, because don't forget, you're also getting the rack when you, when you purchase today. So this rack is what I'll put my salmon on, okay? And then I've just gone ahead and put some of these beet leaves all around the salmon. I'm gonna drop the rack right on into my dish with a little bit of dill over the top. And then, with just a little bit of white wine and a little bit of water, I'm going to pour that in. You're going to see that steam come up in next to no time. We're going to cover it with our lid, which is also the other side of the product. It's Here the, you are, it's, Chef. Oh, you got it. I got okay. one. I got one. Thank you, Dale. Um, so we're going to drop that on there and let that come up to a steam and it's ready in just minutes. While we wait for this beautiful fish and chorizo dish that I'm, I'm gonna prepare for you guys, let's do a whip around and just show everything that we've made so far because there's just so much stuff out here and I want you to be aware of all the different ways you can do it. Oh my. This is like a potato gratin that I'm pulling out right now. Um, and if mm. you give me a spoon, I'm gonna show you yeah, how okay. fabulous this just is. So. You know, check this out. Imagine serving this for the holidays. The scallop potato. Oh my goodness. Right, you can put a little bacon in there if you so choose. Oh, this gets so crazy good. You're gonna get a little good. caramelization on the bottom. By the way, we're halfway sold out of all of these. Yeah, don't miss out, guys. Don't, halfway this is sold the last, out of the entire quantity. The last chance you get for Thanksgiving is today, wow. so. You've gotten the lasagna that you made, I mean. How many people do you, you think that, I mean, that's, that could feed a ton of people, Look, you know? Look, the, the mussels, mm. the, the potatoes, the roast chicken, here come the lamb racks. Wow. We did a French toast, we made biscuits, um, there's Brussels sprouts, there's a giant lasagna. Any and everything. Literally, and, and yeah. then, you, you mentioned before about using it as if it was cast iron. Well, check out, I mean, look at oh, what I'm doing look here. look at that. This is the chicken breast, right? Jeez. Beautiful and golden brown. And like, I talk to you about heat transformation all the time, right? Let me show you what I'm dealing with here. Let me show you this. Have a, can you wow. see that? Go back to the aerial shot, because I want you to see. <laughs> can you see it from the aerial shot? We're literally cooking on a little camp stove, all right? So I want to. I like doing that to show you just how even that heat transformation, because look how golden brown these all are. They're all the same. And it's because we choose the right I'm in material. Awe. I'm we, in awe. I really we, am. Yeah, no, it's really cool. No, it's I'll, really, really cool. Well, three minutes remaining on the clock. One of the final chances to be able to get this before it's sold out. We have black or red. I'm going to ask for a quick update on which one is uh, almost gone. Free shipping and handling. Black is going to be the first to sell out. All right? So $17.49 if you'd like to have it. We're back off to our phone lines. We're going to go to Colorado. Colorado. Where Amy is standing by and says her 15-year-old son, 15-year-old, she didn't say son or daughter, son, is a budding chef. Oh, is that right? Amy, you're live. Yeah. With Amy, Chef Curtis nice. Stone. Hey, Amy. Hello. Yes, my son is a budding chef, and I, I've got your Dura pan for him and myself, and so that he can get cooking as soon as possible. Right, well, you know what, Amy? That's when I started getting serious about my food, right around 14, 15 years old. Uh, I started cooking when I was a little kid, but then, you know, that's when the bug bites you. It starts kicking in, and if you're fostering it, you never know what'll happen. Well, exactly, and he definitely has that bug, and 
I just like your seal of approval on it, the ease of it, and for my family to be able to make quick meals in the morning and dinner. Amazing. But mostly that it's also healthy, and that's what I really want for my family, and not feel like the pan is going to emit any type of chemicals or anything like that. Right. Well, we definitely want to be healthy, Amy, and we, we want to thank you so much for calling us. I'm glad you love it and that your son loves it as well. Thank you for your phone call. Um, these pans are incredible, as we've talked about. This is a roaster pan. It's brand new, uh, giving you a chance to be able to have that undeniably non-stick that's that quantanium that the chef really wanted to give you the very best black is almost gone um we have wow with we have about 500 people that are calling in so we may have enough for one more show but oh, i believe the black will sell out before that show okay my producer said i am correct so yep. here's your way of getting it we needed to have a roaster obviously because of thanksgiving we're roasting we're baking by the mm -hmm. way this would ba uh, make an up for unbelievable cake right rochelle the, oh, yeah. the size of oh, this yeah. wouldn't it be yeah. a great cake? cornbread that you can make oh, in this yeah. season wildly good. It's so funny you talk about cornbread. I love cornbread. Really? Oh, I love it. I just kind of saw the passion there. Oh, no, I love it. it because we don't have it in Australia. So when I first came to the States, I learned all about American food. I traveled around the South and, you know, you guys have such beautiful cuisine in different parts of this right, country. Right, right. And I fell in love with the South and yeah. all the stuff they have down there for well, sure. what do you have burning here? Okay, so this is, um, I'll put it down here so you can get a good shot. It's Parmesan cheese. I just threw it in there. You've seen me do this demonstration before with the Dura Pan, but I want you to know that even though this is a different shape, it is the exact same surface. It has the exact same qualities. We put five layers. It makes it super durable, super strong. Look, this is going to set the alarm off if I'm not careful, but <laughs> I, wa I wanted to show you this because I want to show you just how Whoa. simple it is. When you have a kitchen disaster <laughs> like this, yeah, right? Like Our this. show is live. Watch, watch, watch what happens. I literally wipe that oh, cheese nice. out. Okay. It is, yes, it's black. It's burning. It's burning on my cloth. But you get this beautiful uh, clean pan again, and you're ready to keep on cooking. So mm -hmm. there's just, there's nothing to worry about. In I'll make a caramel in here as well. Wow. Look at the it looks like you put I it in make. the dishwasher. By the way, all of the cookware is dishwasher safe. Mm -hmm. You just won't have to do that, you know? Um, uh, 1,200 of these gone in the roaster. Right. I'm not surprised. I, no. knew, I knew this would be dynamite. I knew that you guys would go crazy for this product because it is just one of those ones that solves so many problems. Right. And as we're on the on the doorstep of Thanksgiving, I know what everyone's going to go through. We're going to be one pan down. We're gonna Always. Be, we're going to be one roaster down. And this is so multifunctional. It can roast. It can stir fry. It can do sides. It can be there for desserts. Imagine a tiramisu or something. Oh, delicious. You know, like some kind of pudding in this. I'm blown away that you're cooking in these guys. I mean, the chef has been using these right on top of the stove, cooking them just like your everyday 11 inch, 13 inch, 12 inch fry pans. Right. So don't ever put these away. Don't use these like you would use a traditional roaster. Fry in them, he said. Fried yep. chicken, fried fish, pop popcorn. Use them as traditional pots and pans. But oh, by the way, when you need that roaster, it's your roaster. And please don't forget that you get that third piece of that rack that comes with it as well. If you'd like to choose it, take it advantage of the holiday price, but sell out quantities only in the black. And $17.49 if you'd like to get that by using our Lex Bay. Uh, this is what we call an extra flex pay event. So if you have that HSN card, you'll get an extra flex pay on anything from Chef Curry Stone. Well, we have something that is brand new oh, that's sure going to be do. coming up. But coming. before we get there, let's show you the multi pan from last hour. Um, it is this number one best selling pan. So if you're just tuning in and you're wondering, I'd love to try Chef Stone's cookware. I just can only buy one thing. That's the pan to buy. We've sold almost 200,000 of that exact pan um, with that Dura Pan nonstick interior with that Quantanium technology. The price on this today is $39.95. That is the price that we offered this pan when it was a today's special. $9.99. I think the fire department might be on its way. <laughs> Nine dollars. I don't know. If they moved the camera because I was going to ask them the show. Uh, the chef is still burning. I'm still cooking. The cameras have gone. They're, the they're, cameras are gone, I'm but the gone. studio is all smoking. Well, I'm just getting warmed up. If you'd like to have that pan, it's nine ninety nine, ten dollars. It is an amazing gift. 
Uh, that pan is the one to have with free shipping, by the way. So come on in, take advantage of it. I'm gonna move over, I'm gonna take my short rib. I'm gonna leave the fire over here. Ooh. Okay. I have to let the chef come on over. Oh, <laughs> sorry. <laughs> I went down there to start playing with our next toy, which I is amazing. You. Okay, I'm back. You've got to tell them about this. Oh, my goodness. This is such an incredible product. It's one of those... We actually... I only bring this here once a year, right? It's right. for the holidays. It's the only time you use it. Last time, you and I sold it out like that. Yep. It's going to happen again, so get ready for it. It's such a beautiful product, though. Do you like chocolate lava cake? Yes. Okay, well, I'm bringing you a steamed pudding basin. It looks like this. You can pick it up from the top. You can pick it up from the side. You, the reason you pick it up from the top is because you drop it in steaming water when you want to steam it. You can bake in it, you can freeze in it, which means you can do all sorts of delicious dips. You can go straight into the fridge. There's so many things to do. I'm gonna start making a chocolate lava cake while you talk you about it. You choose red or gold. That's the only decision you have to make is red or gold or $29.95 free shipping. Over 400 people have already ordered them in advance. It's $9.98. Let's watch the chef uh, make the cake. As he mentioned, it comes one time a year. This is it, and it should sell this out in this airing. All right? It's such an easy thing to do as well. So if you're making a lava cake, you literally make your mix okay and once you get that all combined this is how simple it is and then it goes into the pudding basin um, you know you can bake cakes in this of course you can uh, but this is what I love it for the steamed puddings so the lava cake I'm actually going to bake you pop that in which means we will leave it uncovered right you drop it in the oven 20 minutes or so later you've got this unbelievable cake coming out and let me show it to you because I cheated and I went and put one in of course okay here it is so you just grab yourself a plate bring it to the lava turn it over okay then using a cloth because these will still be warm just go ahead and remove the pudding basin beautiful okay oh look you even get my little c in the top <laughs> oh it um, smells so good doesn't that smell so good and then i always dollop mine with a little bit of cream on top but here's what's so cool about it imagine serving this around the holiday time and then look there's going to be a little bit of chocolate lava just sort of ooze on out. Um, and it's just like a self-sourcing chocolate pudding um, that's just so, so good. Lots and lots of cream. Oh, my gosh. So, and you told me last year, if I remember, that this is something that is traditional. Yep. You know. Yeah, absolutely. Like, we do Christmas pudding, which is right. full of um, um, dried fruit and all of that kind of stuff. But you can do a sticky date pudding as well. Um, let, me show you a, let me show you a steam pudding, because this is how easy it is to make eggs little brown sugar you toss that in you mix that together then you throw in some dates which I've just had soaking you can put a little alcohol if you like some whiskey or some rum you whispered that chef you whisk that in that's because <laughs> I think my five-year-old might be watching <laughs> um, and then you just go ahead whisk that flour through right and that's it you've made your thing you've made your, your base so all, what you need to know is all of these recipes are going to come to you as well so you're going to experiment and be able to create something very different you're quite new to what you've done in the past I've got my so it's two sizes that you get in you get in the biggest size which I'm pouring right now right so there's a stock the sticky toffee put in and as soon as that goes in this is the next step you line it up, there's a little mark there that's going to tell you exactly where to put that on. You twist, right, and then you pick that up and you drop it in boiling water. And Chef, I'm going to chime in because yeah. you get the set of two of these. <laughs> so everyone that's needs right. to know, the way that we have it set up is a little different, but there we go. I found the other one. Hold on. Ooh, there we go. You're getting both sizes. So you get two sizes. Thanks, guys, for that because it was kind of all over there. So you get the set of two. You get both sizes. One is a one quart. The other one is a two quart. Mm -hmm. So you'll get two of them for this price. And you get a number of recipes. I'll have to count them because, unfortunately, on my cards, it doesn't tell me how many. But they did list them all. <laughs> so you'll get two, how many do we get, four, Vanessa? six, eight, ten, recipes. twelve, thirteen recipes. Ten, thirteen. 13. Ah, I counted them all. You get lots. Don't worry. There's 13, including, well, I won't read that one. The boo 
juicy Christmas pudding with vanilla <laughs> cherry sauce. I mean, it's so Berries good. Berries and cream layer cake. I think we've got an example That's of that. That's over there, yeah. The chocolate chip steam pudding cake. You certainly get this one. Have a look, Marla. I'm just going to invert it. Okay, this is the sticky date pudding, right? Mm. So it's steamy. You can see how moist that is. And then you go ahead and you pour a little brandy sauce over the top. Oh, my gosh. Like that. Okay. I don't just know which it. one to try now. Okay, well, I'm going to tell you. Yikes, yikes. Because you are going to absolutely adore this. Let By me By the way, we get the molten dark it. chocolate cake recipe, the streusel Look coffee cake. So you get 13 recipes. Okay, I'm okay, done. Right. I'm done. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> if you'd like to have it, <laughs> one show only, one shot at it only. You'll get both sides. You choose gold or red. Mm -hmm. And gold is most limited. But we, the red is beautiful. The and you get really both nice a two quart and a one quart. And you get all the recipes as well. Okay, right. so here's what they look like. I'm gonna put these in front and I'm gonna try one. Please Should do. Should I try this one? Yes, go for it. Now you can also do um, an ice cream cake. Wow. Um, don't just stare at me, Garcia. Come on, bring me the blowtorch. There it is there. Thank you, my darling. Okay. <laughs> All right, so what we're going to do here, if you have a blowtorch, you can you can do this, where you just throw the blowtorch on it, which is just going to um, melt the side of the ice cream. If you don't, it's still really simple. Get a hot rag, get a get a get a cloth that you've put under hot water, mm. and that will still do the same job. That was so good. Look. Oh wow! Come on. So you get this giant ice cream bomb, I call mm. it. Does that look so cool? Oh, it's so pretty. Isn't it so awesome? And then, you know, you can go in and just cut a oh, slice of that. Oh, nice. So when it's time for dessert, and imagine oh, this. Oh, you're looking for a place to time. put it? Right here. <laughs> <laughs> right here on my plate would be perfect. There you are, Thank my darling. You. Oh, wow. Look at that, guys, though. Right. And there's so cake good. at the bottom. Mm. A little cake. Isn't that great? Sorry, excuse me, with my <laughs> mouthful. Can we, let's show the other side. By the way, yeah. well, you only have one shot at this. It only brings this one time of year. We're going to go a little bit beyond the clock. Right. I, and I apologize, I didn't tell you earlier, but you do get two, okay? Let me show you the red. This is what the red looks like right here. They say, have the table so pretty. It's kind of hard to I mean, see everything. It's so, so easy to do a uh, to do a wow. cake like I, that. Can we show this? Because this is gorgeous. Isn't for the that holidays. beautiful? Yeah, it's gorgeous. so gorgeous. Nice. And that's just literally doing a sponge cake in the tin and then just right. layering Slicing it up however it. you like. Right. You can also do sa a lot of savory stuff. So over here we've got some smoked salmon um, with some cream cheese. And if you see um, over there, you know, obviously this is basically a dip. So you just have people walking along and dipping in. Um, so it's a really beautiful way of doing a lovely dip. Oh my gosh. Mm. So savory, sweet. Uh, you'll get the recipe for that dark uh, molten chocolate cake. You'll mm -hmm. get the recipe for the berries and cream layer cake. You'll get the recipe for that. You sure will. Uh, there's a recipe for the boozy Christmas pudding and vanilla custard sauce as well. Which you've got to try. I mean, once in your lifetime, you just have to try it. What's that one? I have absolutely no idea. Gussie, what have we got? It's a pot pie. Yes, a I pot love pot, pot so, pie. <laughs> so Vanessa's been working hard back there and she made it. She, mm. I, she, I didn't know what it was, so, but it looks fabulous. I've just got nothing to take it out with. Let me get a little fork here. Here. Yeah, so you can use it. You don't have to just use it for a, uh, for a pudding. <laughs> All right, <laughs> okay. so with over almost 700 gone, only day to get this for the entire year. He only brings this today. We have both gold as well as the gold is in the front, and then we have them in red, and then you get both sizes, okay? Both the two quart as well as the one quart. The gold is the most limited, but we also have it in the red. So we can not only use this in the oven, because these are oven safe to 400 degrees, mm -hmm. In the freezer. You can freeze in, straight in you there. Like. Absolutely. There's nothing on here that's going to be damaged in any way, shape, or form. Right. Boiling water. I mean, that's what they're designed for. They're and we're designed out of time. to go to boiling water. Okay. We're going to go to a quick spotlight with Colleen, but when we come back, we'll tell you more about it. Promise us you'll stay with us, okay? Join me, Amy Morrison, and join me, Colleen Lopez, for Gotta, Gotta Watch Thursdays! Colleen Lopez here, and you won't want to miss tonight's Gotta Watch Thursday. First up, get everything you need to look holiday party ready and a pinch on Beauty Report with Amy Morrison. 
She's premiering a Glow Biotics probiotic-infused skincare line designed to improve skin's natural appearance. And get ready for a big today's special pre-sale for Too Faced. The Funfetti Collection is here and will have exclusive items available only on HSN. Then get your natural style started with me on the list at 9 p.m. I'll have curations back with great outerwear including packable down. Plus, faux fur from Adrian Landau to keep you warm and cozy this season. And look no further for sweaters and dusters this year from Marla Wynn. Don't forget, all beauty report and list items are on special pricing. We can't wait for you to join us tonight at 7 p.m. At HSN, we know we're the best way to holiday. This kind of magic happens once a year. Where else can you get fashion tips from me? Or holiday crafting tips from me? Always be mistletoe ready. So come cook with me. Let's decorate together. How you showing? Let's create something great. Oh, what fun it is to make HSN your home for the holidays. 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 slow cooking. We definitely are excited to give you a look at something that's brand new, oh, yeah. something that the chef has been working so hard behind the scenes to bring to you. It happens to be a convection oven, and we're, we've launched it this visit. My name is Marlo. We are here with, of course, Chef Kerstone, and Hello. this is his rotisserie and convection oven, and take a look, guys. Have a look at that. Look at the magic, and look, wow. Does that look so now good? that looks amazing. Tell us a backstory on this, because as we look at that shot of that pizza sizzling in the oven, yeah. tell us why you wanted to bring a, a convection rotisserie oven to us. Well, first of all, I have a little oven like this. It doesn't have the rotisserie um, function built right, in. Right, right. And I'm going to talk about the rotisserie really towards the end, because there's, <coughs> excuse me, so many amazing features in this little oven, and I've had this at home for some time, and you know what? It's great for reheating food. It's amazing as a second oven. We have a, a nice big kitchen and then I have a little kitchenette. Sometimes you don't want to like totally, um, you, you know, use the, the, the kitchen or the big oven. It takes time to heat up. This is super fast to heat. It's got a beautiful broil with infrared. <laughs> Excuse me. Oh my, we gotta, some, <laughs> we gotta get him some water, all right? Thank you. <laughs> it's okay, Excuse Chef. Me. Um, so, you know, I, I wanted to, to create an oven, and by the way, the one I bought, I paid nearly double for. It was 250 I think. We're selling this for less than $150, uh, and it doesn't have the rotisserie. So the rotisserie is a whole separate thing. It's in the same product, of course, but I'm going to demonstrate this oven first of all. Thanks, Kat. Uh, and then I'll eventually get to the rotisserie, because there's so much to show you. I just made a pizza while I was coughing and spluttering right there. Uh, it, it's, it's right here. I'm going to show you how it goes. Let's come over to the little oven that we've got here. I call it little, but let me tell you, it can hold a lot of food. That goes in. Then you turn your oven on. I've got it preset to convection. I want to I uh, decide how much time it's on for. So let's take it to, uh, let's call it 15 degrees, 15 minutes. And then you hit start. That's going to start cooking in a second. Over here, I cheated and I went ahead and put one in just before we got here. It's had probably 15 minutes or so. Which oh, that is, looks perfect. Does that look good or what? Okay, Marla, so have a look at this. It slides off, and what's so important to me with good pizza is that you end up with a delicious, crispy base, okay? So, have a listen. Oh, yeah. You know what I'm yeah. saying? <laughs> <laughs> you need to get that beautiful, That's crunchy awesome. bottom. And of course, I'm cutting this on my, uh, on my board and with my pizza slicer, which is also available. That's perfect. So all of these accessories, by the way, are available. You can order them. Right, it's, That's it's, great. And, and you can do homemade pizza. Of course, this also gets beautiful store-bought pizza, um, a, a delicious crust as well, which, again, is unusual for, for this kind of thing. So that's the pizza that's gone in. Let us let me show you what you do with mac and cheese here. So I've got macaroni, and I've got a little grated cheddar. Um, Kat's gone and made me a beautiful sauce. Thank you, Kat. Excellent. And can we use any type of uh, porcelain or baking dishes? I guess whatever sure you can. would normally use in your oven, you can use 
cheese in this. You absolutely can. Okay, you absolutely which is perfect, can. right? So you mix that together. Yes, stainless steel is fine. Uh, a roasting tray works. You know, you name it. You can bake in this oven really, really well. So if you want to do a mac and cheese, and I'm showing you this for a couple of reasons. A lot of toaster ovens out there are just that. They're just toasting ovens. This is so much more. So I'm going to stick this on convection, um, which is going to get us a nice uh, fan-forced heat. You know, fan-forced is important because it circulates that heat around. So let's go ahead and choose convection. While I'm here, if you can come in close on this, I, wa I want to show you just how simple it is to work through. Oh, for some reason, that blue, it's not, oh, uh, it's not showing up. Anyway, yeah. it doesn't matter. I'm going to go ahead and start it. on top. Is that better? No, no. it doesn't help. That's too bad. Well, they yeah. have one that they can show. Yeah. Okay, yeah. there we oh, go. There they it got is. it. You got it now. Yeah. Um, so look, you know, you, let me show you how easy this is to work. I'm going to start from the start. We turn it on, right? And then you just dial around. And as you dial, you press mode first. You dial around. You can do bake, convection, toast, slow cook, roast, rotisserie, broil, keep warm, even defrost. You can even defrost really in this nice. bad boy. So when, once you choose what you want, it will suggest a temperature. Like they've suggested 350. Which guess what? It's exactly what I want. But if you wanted to change it, you would choose temp and you would go up or down. Just scroll through. But 350 is perfect, and that's how intuitive it is. I'm going to say, let's go ahead and start it. Um, it's saying 40 minutes. Yep, let's go ahead and do it. So that's going to cook the mac and cheese just perfectly. And in fact, I cheated and I threw one in before we got going out over here just to show you how this is going to come out. Oh, that looks so good. Right? Let me grab a plate cat if you don't mind. And by the way, as you're ordering, come on in and say hi to us. We want to talk to you. If you'd love to purchase it, you know, this is the time of year where we need that second oven. And if you entertain for Thanksgiving and you have a large family or you have lots of friends over, uh, this, you already know, your traditional oven is going to be filled to capacity and you'll need a second oven. Look at oh, yeah. how beautiful that cheese is melted on top and how golden Isn't that so it good? is. Well, on Thanksgiving, you're absolutely right. right. Guess what happens on Thanksgiving? Your oven is full of turkey all day long because it Where takes gonna, three hours right. to Where roast it. Where are you gonna put it? the pies? Where are you gonna have right. the cornbread or the rolls but and that sort of thing? With this, you can be doing some of these bigger jobs like um, the turkey. Let me just get that up on my trivet there. Um, you can be doing the turkey or even just using this for the sides or the appetizers and some Suddenly, right. you've kind of doubled your oven space, which is really, really helpful. And I want to show you just how beautifully it crisps. I've got this uh, delicious chicken uh, turkey crown, which is the double breast off a small turkey. Have a listen. Hear that crispy skin? That happens because we've put an infrared um, heat source in the top there. So that infrared just crisps ch chicken skin, turkey skin like you've never That's seen before. That's incredible. Isn't that beautiful? No, I mean, I've n I'm not seen anything quite like it. So this is all brand new. The retail compare is $249. By the way, if you'd like to have the two-piece carving set that the chef is using, oh, yeah. um, because we certainly will need that, uh, we've called it out below. So you can certainly ask about that. But we're going to ship this to you with free shipping. That's pretty impressive to consider that this is an oven. I'll give you the measurements, the size of it. It is not humongous. Uh, it is the ideal size. It's beautiful because it's all done in that brush stainless. Mm -hmm. So it will definitely elevate the look of your home. Um, we've spread the payments out for you. So it's $29.99 a month, interest free. Um, if you use your HSN card, I think it's like $24.99 a month. So very affordable. But it is that convection. You can bake in it, defrost in it, toast mm -hmm. in it. It's that second oven that we all want. You know, a lot of times for customers, it's so much easier for them to be able to have an oven that's on the counter right. as opposed <clears throat> to bending over. Bending down. down that's a good you know. point. So we love that this is kind of eye level. It's going to be a lot easier for you to manage. Use the same type of uh, dishes or pans and baking pieces that you normally would use. You don't have to do anything special. Tell us a little bit about what you're making here, Chef. Okay, so I thought, seeing I've got the turkey, I'm going to give you a couple of turkey ideas for the leftovers. So here's some nachos. Turkey nachos nachos are so delicious. Lots of cheese. Don't be stingy with the cheese. Especially, I'm not especially not going to be because this is going to be my lunch after we're done here. A few more beans on top. Um, some of that beautiful salsa. And then what you do is you throw this back into an oven. Again, fan force is going to be important here because you want that heat circulating around. So I'm going to come over. 
I'm going to drop this mm, in this the front right there. And then let's turn it on. Um, I've got convection is selected. Okay, very good. Uh, so next I want to choose the time. Let's go down to like, what should we do? Five minutes, 10 minutes for these nachos? Maybe, let's call it five. And then you start it and it's going to run right at the temperature you want. Perfect. I'm also going to make some little open face sandwiches. Mm. Um, Kat, you and I are like, what's the synchronized the swimming? today. <laughs> yeah. um, all right, so a little turkey. Beautiful. So you could use the toast function, you could use the broil function. I'd go for broil here because I want a slightly higher temperature. A little bit of cranberry sauce. And I should uh, mention to everyone that uh, your this is going to obviously, your rotisserie, uh, this is going to be great for meats up to five pounds. Oh, yeah. uh, it will fit your bakeware items and it can fit, for example, a quarter sheet tray, a bunt pan, a six cup muffin pan, mm -hmm. uh, this oven will fit, a 12 inch pizza pan, or stone. It can fit an 11 by 7 baking dish. It can fit an 8 by 10 square baking dish without the side handles. A 9 by 5 loaf pan and a 9 inch pie dish. So if you're wondering the capacity in the inside, those are the things that it can fit. I'm going to do my best to give you an inside look. We had someone call earlier to ask about an inside look. Measurement wise for your countertops, and I'm gonna turn this one to the side even so that you can see it. It measures 15 and 1 8 of an inch long, 18 and 7 8 of an inch wide, and 11 by 7 8 of an inch high. 11 and 7 8 of an inch high. So it is not this humongous oven. As a matter of fact, I'm gonna turn it to the side because I think sometimes it helps for you to get a little bit of a side profile. I know my cards yeah. went on the floor, but that's okay. But you can kind of, is that good for you? So you can see that the back portion, they've kind of extended it a little bit, but that's because it allows you to be able to hold mm -hmm. that 12 inch pizza, oh, yeah. that traditional pie pan. You, you want it to be able to hold the things that you're used to so that you can use your same baking dishes. But it's ideal. I mean, this is something that you'll need. You won't ever regret having something like this. You know, you, you and I talked about the microwave and you, you right. said to me that personally for you, you don't care to use a microwave. I don't, and I'll tell you why. I don't like what it does to my food. I don't like things that are soggy. I, I, you know, if I'm gonna use something in a toaster oven, forget about the fact that this actually has a rotisserie in it. And I'm pulling out a rotisserie chicken now so you guys can all see just the quality that I'm talking about. I mean, when you're comparing, even if it's heating up a little bit of lasagna, this does such a better job than mm. something like, I mean, look at this roast chicken. Are you kidding me so right now? So even all the way around. Well, how much do you pay for this at the grocery store? Oh, I know. By the way? And you know, and, and what's in it? You know, that's what I always wonder. What sort of preservatives have they hit no, it with? No, it's so true. And how long have they cooked it for? You and, know, like and, and sometimes it's never it's the dry. seasonings and the flavors that you like, you right. know? Well, here you're in total, you're in total control. You remove um, the, the, uh, the thing that holds it in on both sides, which oh, is really great. easy to do. And then you're going to get the perfect juicy, crispy skin, uh, juicy flesh and crispy skin. Let me cut this string off. Here we go. Um, so if I want to sort of go ahead and take one of the legs, let me show you just how I'm talking about juicy. Let me show you just how juicy I'm talking here because it's so fantastic. You're just never going to believe what a fresh rotisserie chicken actually tastes like. I mean, look at that. Does that lot look like the juiciest thigh you've ever seen in your life? And look how it literally will just fall apart if I pull it apart because of the tenderness. Um, delicious, crispy, crispy skin. That does look so Here, good. Have just a little taste. Sure. I'm just going to put it there Here. for you. That's the skin, and here's a little piece of the thigh. Mm. So good. Right, and then the breast. Delicious. Again, come have a look at this crispy skin here, and then the juice, moist, ridiculous flavor that you're gonna get inside. Now you mentioned you're in charge of the seasoning, and you're absolutely right, Marlo, you can season it basically with whatever you like, okay? So that's a chicken, let me show you what a prime rib looks like off the rotisserie, because this is really special. You know, if you're thinking about the holidays and who's cooking for the holidays, this is kind of a must have. I'm just gonna lift that up. It's also so easy to get things in and out, which is really, really cool. Um, and look at that, beautiful. I mean, come on. It just looks so good, right? So I'm just gonna sit that down. 
And again, I'll show you how easy this is to remove. You'll probably want to use a cloth and you just literally give that one turn there and one turn here. And here we go. Oh my gosh. You pull that out. Gorgeous, isn't that great? So you get, by the way, all of these accessories. One more time. Uh, they come with your oven. This is a rotisserie and a convection oven. So here's mm -hmm. what you get. You get the open housing, you get the oven rack, the multi-purpose uh, rack, the oven tray. You get everything the chef is using. Calm tray. And take a look at this. I mean, this is the magic, right? I mean, right, like this is this is what the holidays are all about, in my opinion. Look at that bark that you have on the outside of the roast beef. And then as I start to carve into this. Beautiful. And you're right before, Milo, both this board and the carving knife also available, but check out this perfectly juicy prime rib Excellent. that's just been rotis on the rotisserie. It's so fantastic. I can't, I mean, here, have a little, just a little taste. Because you get the best of both worlds. You get this juicy outside, uh, juicy inside of the meat, but then also that sort of crust that you develop. I want to mm. do this. I'm going to ask if we can have the cameras maybe pan, and it's going to take a mm -mm -mm. second for our cameras to pan through all of the different ovens. Because whether you're uh, doing a beautiful roast, or a chicken, or a pizza, or macaroni and cheese, or a nine inch pie, pumpkin right. pies, you know, apple pie, strawberry pie, you know, the holidays are here. It's that ideal second oven that you need, you know, all hands on deck for Thanksgiving and throughout the holidays, right? So this is a beautiful way. This is just getting started, but you're gonna love how it lights up, how it's easy to choose baked toast, roast broil, convection, slow cook, rotisserie, keep warm, and defrost. The one thing about a holiday is that you wanna be able to serve everything at the right temperature, but you'll need the ovens and the stove to do it. Your traditional stove is probably not going to be enough. Having the second one is going to be ideal. Here we've got the macaroni and cheese going. Mm -hmm. Here we put something right underneath the broiler. I think oh, yeah. those are our... This yeah. is our little uh, toast that you saw me make just before. Um, and this is the turkey with a little Swiss cheese and cranberry. Oh, those look divine. Don't they look great? <gasps> Yes, another, it looks beautiful. Isn't that so special? Another minute and that'll all be brown and just fantastic. Yeah, that's terrific. And this is, this is what I'm talking about. Imagine trying to do this in your wall oven at home. It would take five, ten minutes before it's even hot. It's so true. I didn't even put that in five or ten right, minutes ago. Right, because yeah. Thanksgiving will use this. Yeah. Um, obviously, that's kind of that overflow that we'll need. Yeah. But Monday through Friday, when it's a breakfast sandwich or a grilled cheese sandwich. Or, or slow cooking. You know, if you're leaving the house yeah. and you want to slow cook for for a number of hours and you don't want to light up the entire that's our um, four quart that came with our, right. our set our sortus absolutely you know, so you all put your put your pans in it and check it out and that's a great example of what can fit in there you know um we've got a minute and a half remaining this is all brand this, new at the holiday price well look at how that falls apart under 30 dollars and very limited almost a thousand have been ordered free shipping and handling for the visit oh, yeah. uh, you will love it makes for a wonderful gift. Um, we're going to show you the inside. I know we promised that, but look at how that falls apart. How many of you are going to be baking cakes for the holiday? Look at this. Right. Okay. So your bunk cakes, your loaf, uh, nine by five loaf cakes can fit in Two this. loaf pans Two. at once. You know, oh, those okay. look amazing. Don't they look so good? Look at how cake. brown they are. And right. guys, this might be a great chance to get in the inside of this. Yeah. So. I actually made this bunt cake in here as well. So a big bunt cake like this also comes straight out of there. You, uh, you can put the rack obviously anywhere you'd like but I don't know if you can see at the top it might be difficult from that angle to even see the heating element um, that's on the very very top of that right there's, so there's heat from the bottom heat from the top we also right. have the infrared from the top which I is know, the it's too uh, bad they can't see that though yeah the next show hopefully we can get a, another type of camera but look at the size wow. of this cake I mean that's my hand is I that have like really a 12 big inch? hands it's a 12 inch, right? Yeah, this is a 12 yeah, inch. Yeah, 12 inch. It. it goes straight on in. That's roomy. And it's still. And you've got it's height. Crazy. And you've got. Oh, there you can see. Now, that's some rock star camera work. Yeah, good job, guys. Who's, good who's, job. who's doing that? <laughs> it's camera one. Camera Ca one. Camera one, but with no name. Jorge, shout out to Jorge for the great camera work. Good job, so there Jorge. you go. He's got that. I wanted you to see that. 
And that's a 12 inch pan, but look at how high. So if you've got, you want to get some height, like you're doing a souffle. Right. Oh, yeah, absolutely. You, you've got the room in there to do uh -huh. the height. And then check this out, guys. So this is uh, some little little cinnamon buns. Six cup muffin pan. A little, like, look at that. You get that caramelization underneath. Yeah, those Again, are beautiful. Again, you can bake. You can also convention bake, which means that you have that fan forced option when right, you want it. Right. So for something like the mashed potatoes, that's what I would. And look, this is a good example. When it's ready, once your timer's gone off, guess what? It just it just starts flashing for you. I'm ready. It gives you a couple of beeps, and then it'll uh, it'll let you know that it's time to take the food out, which is really important. If you don't come back and restart it, it'll turn itself off. So okay, great. It, which is a good thing, right? That's you, safety. It really is. You know, you know you I've not that. seen one that has that type of safety feature. Right. No, you know, it's, you're it's right. You sometimes forget and you get distracted. Wow, that's really large. Right. Guys, can you see that? I don't know. I'm gonna try to pick that up so they can see just how. Sure. Look at how big. Look at how big that is, guys. So a really nice, deep dish that you can see really nice and deep. And then, of course, one more shot before we go, guys. Look at this. I want everybody to see that rotisserie. You get all the accessories along with it. So whatever it is that you want to do, whether you're baking cookies, you've got your mashed potatoes, um, maybe it's just, you know, your breakfast sandwiches, as I mentioned to you, pizza, uh, your roast, and we saw you using that pizza cutter earlier. Right. So we want everybody to have a chance to pick this up. It is a customer pick. Oh, yeah. That is so nice, that Isn't piece. Isn't it so beautiful? Here yes. it is right here. And actually, I think there's another pizza coming out of the oven, the one that we made for you just a few moments ago. So the pizza cutter, what it does is it allows you to go from one side to the other. You can literally rock, use your weight. Oh, thanks, Kat. Yeah, beautiful. Um, and if you would grab that for me, I can do it. Perfect. There we go. Um, so let me show you exactly how it works. <laughs> I know it's hot. Come on, kitty cat, get out of there. Um, you start, you just ground it on one side like that, and you literally just let your your weight roll on through it. So, you know, you just turn it, and again, you're getting right over the top, and it doesn't take any energy at all. It's great for brownies, it's great for, I even use it for watermelon, to be honest, but it's really, uh, really great for pizza, of course. Especially when you get that delicious crispy crust that uh, you know you don't want you don't want your pizza sagging anyway. Oh yeah, look at that, Marlo. You know how to make me hungry. <laughs> well, we wanted to be sure that everybody. Wow, beautiful. So, oh, that's you know what? That's smart too. Right. So the pizza cutter is not only good for pizza, but here's a giant cookie or a, or a little bit of a blondie. Have a look at this. Yum. We love that. So you can cut it in no time at all, which is really cool. Well, if you'd like to shop with us for that pizza cutter, it is available for you. What a nice way for you to be able to pick up some holiday gifts. But we are going to spend the last two minutes the way we started the show. Mm. And we are going to give everybody a look at yes. our door pan. And this is the way it, you're, the, it all started. It is your number one best-selling pan. Mm -hmm. And the, the, that bread pudding looks divine. Doesn't it? If you'd like to have, well, actually, that, what you're seeing on your television, screen is our double-sided roast sure is and that has yeah the I do well. that's that's the roaster pan yeah that's the roaster pan you're saying <laughs> right now and so the roaster pan is brand new. Uh, that is available for you in both red and black. I know that the black is almost sold out. You can certainly choose that, 501-202. And what we have in front of us is our number one best-selling pan. There we go, perfect, guys. And this, well, actually, the graphic, guys, we've got to update the graphic. We have the caddy up on the graphic. <laughs> We're gonna get it right. <laughs> yeah. Here we go. Marlo, I'm going to get you something sweet to eat. We and got we'll it! Worrying about the yes, graphics. the multifunction pan, finally! Mm -hmm. Yes. <laughs> oh my goodness, this tastes so I don't mean to compliment my own work, but this tastes so good! <laughs> So wow. here we go. This is the number one best-selling pan. It's our multi-purpose 14-inch pan. Uh, this is the one that over 200,000 have sold. Uh, it is on special at the lowest price we've ever, even um, the same price as today's special at $39.95 with free shipping. We've sold 6,300 of these pans. Only 3,500 remain. It does come
come with the lid just so that you are aware. I just don't have the lid out here. It comes with the lid. It comes with the recipes. It's $9.99. Buy that one pan and you will forevermore mm -hmm. shop Curtis Stone and HSN. Yeah. Because that one pan almost, I think they're like almost 1,700 reviews, 1,700 reviews. It's crazy. It's his best selling pan of all times. We've sold nearly 7,000 today and we've only done it twice. I know, I yeah. know. It's, it's Everybody loves it. It's beautiful. You wanted to walk us through some of the features. I think we, oh, well, we don't have time. Only 18. Oh, we got 15 seconds in the show. Well, you know, it is the <laughs> one pan that if you buy, you will keep on coming back. I promise you that. Well, when is your next show? I'm um, here back in December. This is the last show of this the is visit? This is Nobody it. Nobody told me that. No, oh, no. Yikes. Okay, so be sure to go to hsn.com. Shop the expanded assortment because this is the last show for the visit. Yep. And also, Chef Curtis Stone supports HSN Cares. Every year we ask many of our guests like you to mm -hmm. uh, design a beautiful ornament. And in purchasing this ornament, uh, it supports the St. Jude Children's Research Hospital, which we know those children get great care and their families don't have to spend any money. So if you're a big fan, you'll want to own your ornament. It's so cool, isn't it? I love it. And it's a great cause. I mean, cook, create and celebrate mm -hmm. and it goes to an amazing cause please 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 go to hsn.com shop the brand new oven shop of course those great pants that we've offered to you and get in on all the free shipping in the flex bay don't miss out on that double roaster for thanksgiving and happy holidays to you and your beautiful thank family you. thank you all right everybody stay tuned